everybody. I know. I what is that? Buddy, I know. I look weird as heck right now. I have shame because school started and I am year two. Last year of high school. Let's start this off with a good old wholesome game. I assume my so-called future girlfriend. Now this isn't Japanese, I'm surprised. It's actually Chinese, which is cool. Or if it's not Chinese, I don't know. But I assume it's Chinese. It sounds a little Chinese. Love does not consist in gazing at each other. But in looking outward together in the same direction. It was late night and I was on my way home. I took the bus, went a couple stops, and got off near the park as always. I crossed the streets, walked a bit further, and took a right into the park entrance. The icy light permeating from the street lamps broke through the darkness and scattered across the park. The flickering light shined on my shoes. I don't know how you realize that, except if you're a beta male, you always look at your feet while you I'm kidding, I do that too. It's not that I was afraid of darkness, but I didn't want to trip over. I didn't re relax just because the path was familiar. I walked neither too slow nor too fast. Tain, I think. I don't know why I tain- Ooh, wait. I walked for a good while, and now I was in front of my house. It doesn't look like it. It looks like you're standing in front of a whammon. Hey. <laughs> Voice acting? Why did you follow me here? The mysterious girl flinched in surprise, but soon put on a wide, embarrassed smile. So you are my future girlfriend! This is definitely not Japanese, I know that much. I saw you sitting on the park bench. You followed me all this way, you weren't shy about it either, so of course I do. So, okay. So, who are you? I didn't hear Tian! Oh, is it Tian then? Not Tian. It's Tian. Sheen. Okay. Uh, yes, I am. What the hell? How did she know my name? The next words that came out of those small wiggling. Wait, what the hell? Wiggling lips were? That's weird to say. Cap! <laughs> what? Nani? I mean, uh, how do you say what in Chinese? Oh, wow, okay. My goals in life is to learn Chinese and Japanese, and maybe another language? I don't know. I was accustomed to being alone. I felt uncomfortable around others. That was the life I was living. I don't think I'm special in any way. FACTS! Anyone has their own boundaries that others can't cross, no matter how big or small. I was only a little more strict with those boundaries. You'd be, sh you'd be surprised how many people have the same set of unique standards. Regardless of the reason, there was a certain realm others couldn't enter. So I thought a guy like me would never really get involved with another human being. FACTS! But some, sh but a strange girl, but, well, but some strange girl just blew up the fence and barged right inside. What a ridiculous, with a ridiculous story at that. Hmm. Yeah, that's... And you let her in your yard. Oh, you simp! To be honest, to be honest, if, if a whammon or a dude came up to you and be like, yeah, I'm your future spouse, would you let them into your home if they were really good looking? Ah, uh, I'll, I'll let that set it, okay? My so-called future girlfriend, quietly drinking tea behind a table at the center of my living room. Is the order a rabbit? Is that a saying? I don't know. I'll Google it later. Oh, she's got four, um, flowers blossoming from her face. When I first heard what she said, I thought she was crazy. I mean, she's got to be a little loopy in the head, so I allowed her into my house. You dumbass. I can't be the only one who'd think that. Yeah, a girl pops out of nowhere and tells me she's my future girlfriend. That's ridiculous. Or, wait, is that it? Time leap? The girlfriend who lived through time? 
What sci-fi world am I in right now? Hmm. I don't know. It's too early to say. What? This is definitely Chinese. I recognize this from Kung Fu Kid. Or is it Kung Fu? No? I forgot. Will Smith's son plays in it? Oh man, Jackie Chad is such a legend. Sorry, I'm not interested in religion. <laughs> I am your... Wait. <laughs> religion? What do you mean? Did you mean cult? What does he mean? Oh, wait. What's there to think about? We never met before. A girlfriend aside, I don't even have that many friends in the first place. Look, you and I just met. Isn't it normal for us not to know each other? Or to not know? First, first met? Hmm. What's up with this girl? Why is she mulling over such a blatant fact? Well, yes, this is my... Oh, shouldn't we really tell her this is our residence? I don't know! She followed me without knowing where she's heading. I took a slight glance to the back towards the door to my house. Yeah, well, as you can see, I'm in front of my house. Stop being all hair and go back to your house! Well, though, I must head inside immediately to relieve some of my stress. So you could stop talking gibberish this late at night and go back to your own house. That was short but sweet. Take care. With those words, I was about to head inside, but my so-called future girlfriend stopped me. <laughs> oh! And I'm not being racist, okay? I thought there was anime, and anime is originally always in Japan, you know? Um, de depending on what you agree on with the whole Avatar uh, debate, you know? Like, they say Avatar isn't really Japanese, um, I mean, uh, anime because it's not from originally from uh, Japan. So, I th like to think that, okay, maybe it's a cartoon, maybe, but I don't know. It's... Maybe one day uh, anime can be anything, but to be fair, Jap Japan created anime, so who are we to say that something we created is like their thing? It's it's kind of like South Africa saying that we're the rainbow nation, and then someone else saying, no, we are the rainbow nation. And yeah, I, I can understand the, the debate, but uh, I don't know, I'm pretty pretty neutral I don't really care it's so long the story is fine I don't care what you call it um oh what I'm repeating myself but we've never met before you just had a uh, steamy first hello a minute ago what makes you think you can ask me that ah yes my logic again? Am I being punked right now? Is that a popular show? My future? Then why did he dump you on me? Or why did I dump you on me? Wait, that doesn't make sense! Was I, was I about to die? Or... I don't understand. Still talking about that future, huh? She's not wearing a hospital gown, so I don't think she escaped from a mental asylum. Hospital? Do you let her go inside her house? I mean, all she was wearing was a light pink sweater over short pants that were barely visible and a pair of stock stockings. Oh, now that you met- wait, no, that- that is- is that her skin? Nah, that can't be, that's- Spring clothes in the middle of winter? Of course he's cold. I was wearing a coat, but it barely stopped me from shivering when the wind blew. Ooh, it's that cold. I stared into her eyes. 
and the words just spilled out of my mouth as if I were possessed. If it's just for a moment, in spite of myself, I said yes to letting her inside. She had pretty eyes, so of course. Yeah, you're gonna regret this, buddy. <laughs> I'm only saying this just in case there's a misunderstanding, but it was definitely not as if she was a mastermind at controlling other people's thoughts or something. I don't really enjoy talking to people, so I have zero immunity against people who appeal to your emotions. I can't really be harsh when someone's trying to soften me up, and it's always harder to ignore a stranger who comes at you with a smile. To be honest, she was starting to shiver pretty hard for the whole- Yeah, yeah, you're a damn simp, accept it. She's a total stranger. What's the worst a small kind gesture can lead to? You- You'd be surprised! Do one nice thing, and it's the end of the world. A, per a persona non grata happily drinking steaming tea in front of me. As promised, I don't think she's going to do anything weird. Are you feeling warm now? Since things seem more mellow now, it's Q&A time. Then I have to ask you. My so-called girlfriend tilts her neck. What's your name? Oh, I... <laughs> Oh, no, her name is Girlfriend. Uh, you have something mixed up. I was a bit taken aback by how sullen she looked. So, um, did I say something wrong? Did she expect us to know her name already? Like, I don't know you, woman. What could I have said wrong? I just asked her name. Uh, Yurin. 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 Took a while to get that out of her. Anyways, it's a pretty name. It's a pretty name. <laughs> My so-called girlfriend, I mean Yurin, opened her eyes wide. I didn't mean to say that out loud. It happened from always being alone in the house. That's a bit embarrassing. <laughs> but she's the one blushing. <laughs> <laughs> now what's Chinese type of anime called then? Then it's not anime, it's gotta be called something else. Yeah, I don't know. I never thought about Chinese, China having anime too, so wow. I'm gonna look into that. My reality's being taken over by a rom-com. Yeah, finally! Woo! One thing I like. This is dangerous. It is indeed, buddy. I'm not used to a situation like this. What should I ask now? Well, you know what to ask. Oh, wait. What do you mean by future girlfriend? How old are you? Wah! Yes! Yes! FBI! Wait! Wait! How old are you? How old are you? Personally, that's what I wanted to know most. Yeah, me too. Every man should know this. Forget that it's impolite to ask a woman's age. You need to know if she's legal, okay? Men! Don't risk the FBI crashing into your house. Ask women how old they are. Okay. Bright brown hair long enough to cover her entire back, slender figure, and a pretty face. She must be 12. FBI, open up! She's definitely what you call pretty. No, okay, okay, I'm not, I'm not body shaming. I'm not body shaming. I'm just, I'm just kidding. But her obvious short stature, petite build, and considerably flat chest. Uh, what am I saying right now? Anyways, I got the impression that she's young. What? <laughs> oh, okay. Twenty. <laughs> How many people would believe her when she says she's twenty with those looks? She's so tiny. By tiny, I mean well. Think what you will. Ah, uh, the tea. <laughs> So we mean if, so we've been together for five years or five years time we're already in a relationship i don't know for how long but we've been in a relationship so uh okay 
Oh, okay, yeah. Crisis is just like that, she fell into a whirlwind of confusion all by herself. Oh gosh, she's been neglected. But how did she know my age? Background check? Stalker? That's a bit creepy. Hmm. Uh, what do you mean by- We already know what she means, but I'll just ask anyway. What's the story you've been pushing for yourself, my future girlfriend? Is she messing with me? I'm pretty faithful to reality, thanks. expect me to believe you when I just met you. I mean, that would make me kind of an, an idiot. Yes, yes, I can. But I can't trust you immediately. I, still, I seriously have no clue. Well, uh, Taina, um, I don't know. I don't know. You, you know, uh, you did try to explain a couple times, but the frustration got to her and she got mad. She got mad. <laughs> I'm your future girlfriend, we love each other, we were so happy, you will be my senpai again today! But, but why though? Why did you come here? Why? It, why did my future self dump you with the past self? Are you... Wait, did you... Wait, okay, okay, wait. The only way this would make sense is if we actually broke it up and she came back to the past to try again. That's the only thing that would make sense. She screamed at me, but I hardly blinked. I have a very indifferent personality. That's why I have zero friends. Very impressive, my guy. The trinity of indifference, numbness, and insensitivity. That's me! Anyways, this made me sure of it. I get what you're up to. De? De? Oh, de. Oh, that's how you say it. Okay, de. I watched her as she caught her breath and enunciated every word. You're an angsty, delusional teen! Of course! I said to her confidently as she stared at me in silence with empty eyes. Go from the future, huh? That's a pretty good setup, but I mean, it's just way too ridiculous. Now with that, I'm ending today's episode. I know, I know, stuff is getting interesting, I think. It's not at the climax, but I mean, it's it's getting there, it's getting there. So, um, I'm ending this here, recording's getting kind of long, and I probably have some stuff to do to get ready for school! Just kidding, I'm just doing the recording now. I, I ain't doing something too seriously, but uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I'll see you guys and gals in my next video. Hopefully that's this game or Epic Conquest 2! Woo! Bye bye